Hello and welcome to Victoria Planet. My name's John Finch. Today I want to talk about macro photography. It's something that I really like to do. I love getting real close-ups of things and getting all that detail in. Now, I don't have one of those fancy macro lenses, but what I do have is a 50 millimeter lens on my old camera that I can reverse. Let's see how that works. So the next thing I need to do is to set up the watch parallel to the camera. So I've got it pretty parallel and this is important for that depth of field because there is not going to be much depth of field at all with this photograph. So I really need to try to get everything as as flat as possible to the camera film. Now, of course, if you're taking a photograph of a flower or a bug or something, it's not going to be that easy. So you're only going to get a very shallow, focused depth of field on your shot. After I've set that up, I need to take a meter reading. So here's my meter. I'm taking an incident meter reading. I wish the sun was out today. This is pretty slow, but I've got F11 at an eighth. So I'll go to an eighth and F11. So that's far too slow. So I'm going to go to a 15th at eight. That's still a bit slow. I'm not happy with that. So a 30th at five, six. I think I might get a good shot at that. Okay, so macro. I can't focus my camera this close to that watch. But what I can do is reverse the lens. So I'm going to take the lens off and I'm keeping my f-stop at f5.6 and then I'm going to place the lens reversed against the camera body and now I need to focus my shot now the, it's a little bit out of focus I need to bring this towards me a little bit gotta be very gentle because I don't want to knock it over ah there we are, very nice. Now you can move your, your lens back and forth very slightly to help get the focus, but I think I've got it now, only because this is the fourth take of this scene. So there we are, and I'm gonna take my shot. So that was a lot of fun. I bracketed around the exposure a little bit, but actually the first shot was probably as good as any of them, and that's a print from it. I really like that. I'm gonna put that in a frame and I'm gonna put that in the house. That's such a great shot. Thanks for watching. If you like these kind of videos, give me a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. And remember to click that little bell icon so that you'll get told every time one of my videos comes up. Thanks ever so much for watching and I'll see you again later in the week with a tip 